Hey there to everybody out there who is a targeted individual with uh, remote neural monitoring and uh, V2K. I've got to tell you that one way to get your case heard um, involving remote neural monitoring is very simply to call it a HIPAA violation. It is against the law to divulge the medical records of an individual. And that is what remote neural monitoring is. It's the biometric data that is recorded and stored and then translated into speech or sound, sight and thought. So, don't necessarily take on the program because that's off limits and the federal government has figured out a way to get that point across by claiming it is a matter of national security. What is not a matter of national security are your own private records. And they have been disseminated or distributed. So if there is knowledge that is obtained from inside the privacy of somebody's home or vehicle or wherever you are, um, it's actually a HIPAA violation that's occurring. So I don't think the government's going to have very much success in blocking that type of a lawsuit. At least I'm willing to give it a try because uh, I believe that information has been um, given to either my friends or family or people who have called the police and uh, maybe even the government and uh, been told things. So um, you know, just throwing that out there, I'm, go I'm going to have to sue the Columbus Division of Police anyway for the HIPAA violation that uh, there's been brain trauma because there is no brain trauma. I have 100% capacity. There's nothing that is lacking in my mental faculties. And uh, the friends that I have just don't believe it. <laughs> and uh, there's nothing wrong. And they continue to claim, well, he's hearing voices that aren't there. That's called the microwave auditory effect. And it is possible with microwaves. And it is being done. There's, there's no two ways around that. There's no medicine that will make microwaves not go into your head. It's going to go in there and it's going to vibrate the inner ear, which is attached to the skull. So what's actually happening is my skull is vibrating. This is slowly creating brain cancer. And the more that my friends don't accept the truth, the sooner I'm going to die. So you need to change your thinking and accept the fact that I'm telling the truth. Because my friends are killing me by not assisting. My neighbors are contributing to my early death by not providing answers. This is a sick tale of wait and see. And I think my, uh, the, the few neighbors who were really gung-ho on my removal, which would be uh, disastrous for them because then the damages get really steep. And then there's pain and suffering involved in that. 
I don't know why you would ever desire to have somebody else's property and something they own to be taken away from them. That is hideous. And it's not loving thy neighbor. You wouldn't like to be treated like that. So why the hell are you doing it to me? Friends, you need to change your thinking. Because I am right. And don't you ever forget it.